Hello everyone and welcome. Today we are gonna look at the Dynamist deck from the NNR event. This deck is really <laughs> kind of strange, but it's a pendulum deck you can play in the event. It kind it's kind of strong because of the Dynamist Spinos, which if you tribute one of your Dynamist monsters, it can make two attacks in one turn or it can attack directly. So you summon this card with a trap card, Dynamist Rush, which lets you summon one Dynamist monster from your deck and it's unaffected by other card's effects and also destroy during the end phase. So with this card you bring it, you make its attack, uh, for example with the mage power buffed up and also the field spell buff can buff the attack power of the Dynamist Spinus and then you tribute one more Dynamist monster from your field and make it able to attack twice so this is really nice damage and will definitely finish most games you could play cards like moon mirror shoot somewhere in some somewhere in here for example something like like this maybe better you play the watch card which can be special summon from the hand and in the end phase will banish itself to swap for a continuous spell card which in this instance is a Dynamis Charge, which is a really important card for the deck. Upon activation, it adds one Dynamis monster from your deck to your hand. And once per turn, if a Dynamis card card is added from the field to the extra deck, you can add that card directly to the hand. So, the trick with the Dynamists is that in their pendulum zones, most of them protect other Dynamis monsters on the field from targeting or destruction or battle by destroying themselves in the pendulum zone so with this card you can make this destruction practically add to add your card to the hand so you don't get the minus you, you just get the card back in your hand which is really good so for example once while this card is in your pendulum zone you can negate an activated card and effect the enemy is back on negates a card and effect the Placeos negate card and effect that target Dynamist monsters. The Stegosaurus by battle card effect would be destroyed. And then the Pteran protect your Dynamist cards from being destroyed by battle card effects by destroying itself. So with the continuous spell card you can return it to the hand instead and it's really good in the control game. So you basically run these monsters to put in a pendulum zones to protect the bigger monsters and your win condition is the Spinos which should be buffed up by all these spells and you should attack twice per turn with him and absolutely destroy your enemies and with this variation we build to run a couple of, uh, of traps to destroy and interrupt your opponent if you go first and in the extra deck you run cards like Berserker of Tenny, Triple Burst, Digital Buck, Dig Vorzak King of Heavy and number 61 Volcazaurus because you can make it with your Spinus and Ceratops because they are level 5 also with the Brachion so yep you can make Penta stack above the Spinus to make it your PR's damage. And yep guys, this is the deck. It's kind of fun. I wish Dynamist could also get the support like the Tremit deck I made recently. Because they look cool but they don't have many cards and they aren't uh, particularly strong in a normal environment. They could be in this event because most of the decks are slow and methodical and you could steal some wins with the Dynamis Spinos. I personally lost to one player with the Dynamis, this Dynamis deck with the Tremit and <laughs> I got it from him and I was, oh wow, Dynamists, I will try them out. So I'm presenting the deck now and if you want to build it, don't fear almost all, every card here is a normal card so you have plenty and you, you could try that deck in the event and tell in the comments how you feel about it so 
this is it for me now i will see you next time with another deck profile